My middle daughter, who's 26, had a really close friend in high school. And a few years ago, we talked about this friend because we hadn't seen her for some time. And my middle daughter came and told me that her friend was really being held hostage in an apartment. She'd met a man and she thought this was a really nice man and she moved in with him to the apartment and after a few months, the doors were locked, the food was ordered in and brought to her and she was not allowed to leave. And this was three or four blocks from where we lived and this was right down the street from where I grew up as a child. And my daughter said, what should we do? What can we do? And we did go tell her parents and all I think we can do when we see someone who's locked into a situation like that, as women, call me, come to me, I can go to your parents, you can come to me, I'll take care of you. And we told her, if you can figure out how to get away, you can come to my house. And our male friends will certainly protect you. I'm not saying it has to be only women, you need men to help you too. And we said, we will call our uncles and our cousins and they will protect you if you come to our house. But if you can leave, we'll be there for you. And the best thing I think we can do to help someone in a situation like that, whether you see someone who's being physically abused, or even you can tell from their voice that they're not allowed to leave their apartment, is to make sure that they get the message, whether it's in person or even a text or anything, if you decide to come to my house, we will be fine. Even if you have to speak in code to let that person know even if I have to get other men to help, I will be there to help you.